In this task, we're just going to run the cell that's been provided for you to see how a definition of a function works. So if we just run this cell, nothing happens. We'll get to that in a second. But we can break the cell down into different components. First, def, which is short for define, says we're going to define a function here. We've called the function my function with an underscore, and we've given it two brackets. You might remember from every time that we've used a function, there's always a pair of parentheses involved. The next thing is we've got a colon that says everything after this is my function. Just like with a for loop or an if statement, every line inside our function is indented. This function just prints something, a string, and then it returns nothing. That's fine for our function because we want it to give an output, which is a print, but many functions might return a number, and we'll do that in future tasks. The reason it doesn't print anything is because the function hasn't been called. So even though we've defined it, we've never used it. So by adding this line, I've defined my function here, and then I've used it here. We now print my custom function has been called.